To answer your question, yes, I do know I'm amazing. It is Friday, September 18th. It has almost been a month of this. Crazy. Um, I have a couple good news. Um, you may actually see me before you watch this. Um, I'm coming home tonight, I think. I won't be there for, like, dinner, but I'm going to try to do some homework and then leave, like, right before it gets dark, but I need to wait until traffic is gone because I'm not driving home in traffic. Um, let's see. I have some good news. Um, more good news, that is. Um, I got another English paperback, and on a scale of check minus, which is, um, really needs work, to check, which is, you did what you were told, but that's about it, to check plus, which is, you pretty much did exactly what you should have done, and you really understood the assignment and did it very well. Um, I'd just like to say... only Jack Plus in the class. <clears throat> yeah, that was me. I was really excited to find out that I was the only Jack Plus in the class. Um, she really likes my writing. I think it's because um, she is she has a master's in creative writing, and so she kind of like leans toward that. Basically, it's, uh, the assignment was... Um, um, well, there are two options. The one I did was you had to observe a place for 15 minutes, write a, write a summary of what you saw in a positive reflection, and then a negative reflection, to talking about the same place at the same time, but um, one in positive, one in negative. And then, um, then you had to write a response saying why the two were so different, um, and how you doing that is going to make you a better writer, is basically the gist of it. Um, I'll just give you kind of an overview of what I said for um, the positive and negative. I did the uh, I sat in the bottom floor of our library where you can see inside and outside because I figured well that's more to write about so good. Um, many students of the university turn to the MD Sanderson Library as an accessible place to study, do research, get homework finished. Uh, other students hard at work. One may find friendly students chatting, a napping upperclassman who worked tirelessly the previous night to perfect a due assignment. Um, Student looks out the window, sees a peaceful environment. A group of freshmen watching upperclassmen skillfully toss a frisbee. Um, buddies sharing gossip, uh, sharing friendly gossip. Um, all under the sun, peeking its head out from behind a cloud. The negative. Um, uh, it's hard to comprehend why students use the Andy Anderson Library to attempt their studies. Um, students expect a quiet and calm working environment, but to find something else. A uh, dull roar of students streaming in and out, uh, struggle to tune out the loud and sometimes crude conversations going on, ever-frequent snores of, an upper, of a sleeping upperclassman who stayed up all night um, working on an assignment that was given weeks ago because he decided to procrastinate, um, looking through the haze of smoke being emitted from a group, sharing a pack of cigarettes, disappointed freshmen watching hopelessly, wishing to join the group of upperclassmen throwing a frisbee, as a group of clouds begins to overtake the sun and cast a shadow over the dismal study, or lack thereof, spot. And she loved it. Like, she wrote how much... Like, there are only a couple things... There's one thing she corrected, because instead of saying, like, also, a student looks out the window to see a peaceful environment, not... But I wrote, a student may have to look out the window. And that kind of sounds negative. But other than that, she liked it a lot. And then, my reflection... My thesis was essentially, for each viewpoint given any situation, there will always be a counter viewpoint. And how... Um... Uh, when, um, I came to understand a new knowledge of argument. B.S. I understood already. Um, I'm opinionated myself, and I always find it reasonable to argue my point of view. Uh, but this activity makes it obvious that no argument is complete, or at least as effective as it could be, without taking into account all other viewpoints. Who knows, maybe a glass half empty may look pleasant through someone else's spectacles. Um, and she said, this is key. Arguments will be strengthened when you consider other viewpoints. Fantastic. Um, but then the one thing, she, um, she took a, um, a quote from my paper and shared it with the class, like, without telling him it was mine. Um, she wrote, this is before we got our papers back. It's like the day we got our papers back, not yet. Um, she wrote on the board, by definition, opinions are not right or wrong, so an analyst may only hope to support the opinion that they agree with. Um, 
so I'm reading on the board, I'm like, Terry, Tracy, that's my quote. And they're like, you like used it in your paper, like you found somebody that said that? No, like I wrote that. Like, I made that up. They're like, oh, that's so good. And then I'm like, oh, cool. And then she says it, and then she, like after she reads it and explains why she thought that it really summed up what this paper should have been, um, she was like, oh, but you know, I didn't even notice this, but the he, she, or the they should be he, she, and agree should be agree. So it should be like support the opinion that he or she agrees with, not that they agree with, because the antecedent is an analyst. And I was like, oh my god, I cannot believe I did that. And then I got my paper back. You see that right in the middle there? He, she agrees? Yeah. I wrote that. Crazy. Anyway, so I was really excited. I have the highest grade in the class. We've only had two assignments, and I've gotten the high. I got the high grade on this paper. I was the only check plus. And then, yeah, <laughs> that other paper I told you about that I was excited. Two got. Uh, I can think of two. Uh, I don't. Uh, I don't know if one of them counts. Does Travis count? Um, Travis, if you're watching this, I'm totally kidding. I'm gonna guess that the fact is. You, mm, that you've liked three boys that have turned out to be gay? That's my guess. I don't know. I have no idea. I hope it's right. I'll guess counter tenor. I bet it's not right. I don't really care. I have no idea. I think that's a mean question. Now to think of my question. I have a question. Thank God. Okay, um... I'm pretty sure you know this, and if you don't, I don't care. Um, <laughs> just kidding. A little. Um, what song from across the universe is on my playlist with Michael? Stay in school, don't do drugs.